Hi, Hiram here. I'm going to do another test on this modified low pressure side burner. This will be pretty much the same thing as my last video, except in that one, the wicking uh, that came across the top was halfway across the can and then halfway across the can. But in the burn test, the wicking only burned at the holes where the, the wicking goes in to get alcohol. There was like half of the wick in between just didn't light. So what I did was I punched two more holes in the stove using my handy uh, deep hand punch. This is a Harbor Freight type thing. Used to be. I don't think they carry it anymore. I haven't seen it in a while. But I punched two more holes and put another piece of wicking in so that now the can is split up in quarters and each end of the wicking on the quarter can get that alcohol. This is the same wicking as like what people use on their pots so that they can touch them when they're hot. Same stuff. So what I'm going to do now is put alcohol in here, let it soak. I'll set up the stand again and when I come back it will be on camera too. Also sorry about that on this. This is my second camera. The mic on this thing just not, doesn't work very well with up close. I'll try talking softer but I don't know what it will do. So, sorry about that. So, I'll be right back. Okay, I've got the alcohol soaking in the can, in the stove rather. It's again one fluid ounce of methanol. Let me try lightning, lighting this. Turning on the timer. Well, that time the flame is all the way around the can. So, that's pretty good. kind of looks like maybe I could lower the wick a little bit. The flame is like a sixteenth of an inch above the jet holes. Okay, now I have water in this, but it's unmeasured water and it's room temperature, so it's probably about 58 degrees. Do it a little fanning here. Already the jets are trying to pick up. Come on. Looks like it's getting ready to catch. Okay, the flames have, or the jets have a little bit of burn in them. Last time it took about 2 minutes and 28 seconds for the jets to catch on. Hmm. I don't know, it really looks like if I had lowered that wick just a little bit, that it'd be right, the flames would be right in touch with the jets. Okay, I'd say the jets have caught. Well, pretty near anyway. Come on. Yeah, I'd say the jets are on, and that's 1 minute 30 seconds about. 1 minute 30 seconds. So this is mod 4A, but I think maybe there'll be a mod 4B. I'll try another one lowering the wick just a little bit so the, the wick is right above the holes. Maybe that'll hatch em, help them catch on faster. Huh. Okay. So, I might just do a boil test on this before I move on. I just wanted to see if this would light the jets up faster doing this. As it was, all four sections of the wick were lit this time. So that apparently works. So I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.